Hello everybody, today I'm going to be making Lucky Charms crepes. These are super simple crepes to make and I'm going to flare it up with some Lucky Charms. So let's get started. First we're going to need two eggs, two tablespoons of sugar, one tablespoon of vanilla. Now whisk that together until the sugar is incorporated into the eggs. Now we will add one and a third cup of milk and two tablespoons of canola oil and one cup of flour. Now this is a very important part. Make sure you whisk this well. There are no clumps. It becomes light and airy and there are some foamy bubbles along the edges. If you're not a fan of the whisking, you can also use a blender and blend it up super well. Now we're going to add in five drops of green food coloring. Whisk that in, and if it doesn't have the nice green color you want, go ahead and add more. Do it to your liking. Now that the crepe batter is ready, I'm going to pull out my griddle. It's a crepe griddle to be exact. I put it on a medium low heat. I usually add a little bit of butter to it. I put it all along the surface, and then I let it bubble up, wipe it off with a towel, and I start cooking. I found that the best technique for a perfect crepe Use a big ladle, pour it out, and use a ladle to make it into a bigger circle as so. If you do not have a griddle and you want to use a pan, that will work just the same. Use a nonstick, use butter. After you have the crepe batter down about 30 to 45 seconds, it'll be ready to flip. Flip it over, finish the cooking, and take it off the griddle as soon as possible. Now continue to cook until all that crepe batter is gone. Once your crepes are cooled down, we're going to start filling them with a little bit of whipped cream. I fold my crepes differently, so this is why I put two little dots, fold the edge over, and then the other little quarter I fill up with more whipped cream and fold that edge over. And repeat that process to the rest of your crepes. Another way to do the same style is fold the crepe into quarters and fill the inside little pockets with the whipped cream. Now that we got them all filled, let's plate. And don't forget to add your Lucky Charms marshmallows right on top. Well there you guys have it, Lucky Charms crepes. Hope you guys all enjoyed this video, I had fun making it. And I hope you guys are as excited as we are about St. Patrick's Day coming up. So, be ready.